Hello, this is movie review number 1134. This is Empire Waste. Empire Waste is the 2024 movie that is directed by Creo Arub. Creo Arub. A Y O U B. Arub. This is from Blue Fast Entertainment, Wayfair Studios, P and G Studios, and Try Anyway Productions. P and G that stands for Procter and Gamble. I never thought there would be a movie studio, P and G Studios. I heard of the company P and G Procter and Gamble. Actually, I actually live to live near one of them. So Empire Waste is a movie that I saw on September 28th, 2024 at Regal Cinema 16 in Deerfield Town Center, Mason, Ohio. So, Empire Waste is about Renor. Renor is portrayed by Mia Kaplan in the movie. She is a teen that is deeply insecure about her weight. She is hiding her passion for fashion design, and she tries to make herself invisible in her day-to-day -day life to avoid being bullied by her classmates, an image-conscious mother who is portrayed by Missy Pryor in the movie. Renault's father, Mark, who is portrayed by Wayne Wilson, is her biggest cheerleader and her best is her biggest cheerleader, and her best friend Kayla, who is portrayed by Gemina Yevu, Y E V U, is confident, funny, outgoing, and she is proud of her body. Through their support, along with teacher Mrs. Hall, portrayed by Joanne Purdy, Renault is encouraged to step outside her comfort zone and embrace her talent, despite what anyone says. Well, this was pretty good. So, in the movie, Renault and Kara become classmates along with partners for a project, and so Kara goes to Renault's house, and that's when Kara finds out that Renault likes to design fashion clothing. And she asks Renault to make her a dress, which she does, and she is in love with the dress. She loves the dress, but also how Renault is able to make these dresses. And then, a party of two becomes a party of five, as three more girls are loving the dresses that Renault is making for them. And with the encouragement of her new friends, along with their teacher, Mrs. Hall, Along with her father, she decides to enter in the competition, a fashion design competition, that will allow Lenore to embrace her talent. Unfortunately, though, there are going to be people in the movie that oppose of this and try to bring her, bring her down. In which state, there was some tension between Lenore and her mother, as her mother was just wanting her daughter to be perfect. To be fit, to be just right like her. And Renault doesn't want that. She wants to be, Renault wants to be herself. Despite what people say, Renault just wants to be herself. And she is very proud of the clothing that she designed. Even her friends are proud of what she has accomplished, and they want her to be part of this competition. So, this is a movie that explores someone trying to embrace their talent and not let people judge them for their appearances or what they look like. Judging, but this movie is broad for how someone should be judged or treated based on the inside of themselves rather than the outside. And despite what a person looks like, anyone can definitely look good. And that was a message that I write in this movie. Renault definitely gets her confidence back when she has her friends around and with the help of her father and her teacher along with many others, she gets the confidence to be part of this competition. While I won't say if she wins or not, the message becomes clear. That at the beginning of the movie, she is not exactly confident in herself, she tries to be invisible. That's not the case at the, at the end of the movie, 
She is becoming more confident. She wants to be a part of life now. And she is proud of who she is and, and who she wants to become. That's a really good message I like in this movie. I definitely recommend it. And I'm really glad that Procter & Gamble got to make a movie studio. Got to be involved with a movie. Like I said, definitely never thought that PNG Studios would be a movie studio. But when I saw that in the movie trailer for Empire Race, I'm like, really? I never know that. I wonder what PNG Studios would do next. We will see. So that's my movie review of Empire Race. Please enjoy my next movie review. Alright, goodbye.